Welcome back everyone to my fourth video of Vlogmas. This is gonna be an especially different one. First person view inside my life. A more personal look on my environment and what I have to work with. This here is just my room. We are gonna start off with the desk area. Here we are. What I have for audio is a Bluetooth speaker hooked up to this monitor. I initially didn't have any speakers, so this is better than nothing. When I want to be extra introverted, this is where I go. Noise cancelling headphones, they work perfect. This is my computer setup. It gets all the videos done in no time, which is awesome. This laptop got the job done for about a year and a half to two. Here's my hard drives. I got two more coming because those are starting to fill up. Up here, we got my mini computer. This setup is super compact. As you can see, the graphics card is right here. All that, it packs a punch. Don't underestimate it. Some cool homemade jewelry stuff. Books, my favorite thing, yet I need to start reading more. That's a habit I want to instill soon and that will come in a future video. A nice little stay stubborn decoration. Thanks to Dylan, shout out to her. This about sums up the desk setup. I am in love with how it flows with the room as a whole. This is my sleeping area. Combined with storage. Yeah, not a lot of people do this or I feel like they don't if anything They would get a loft mainly wanted a bunk bed due to because the previous college I went to I had to sleep on a boat It was a room with three bunks and I loved the bottom bunk it feels like a cave What's awesome about this is that I have so much storage if I didn't have this all of it would be probably on the ground or something as most of you guys are car guys you guys will understand me there's a lot of car parts that you need to store I hate to clutter my room why not store it up here although some did overflow my favorite wheels and two subwoofers I love it I would hate to call myself a minimalist because I have so much stuff all that stuff is for a purpose you could call me an essentialist where everything is quality and meaningful. I wouldn't self-diagnose myself like that. What do you guys think? Do you think I'm hoarding as much stuff as possible in my room in such a confined space or borderline minimalist? I don't think so. I honestly think I'm more on the essentialist side. I did try minimalist methods such as Project 333. That's for another video. Let's move along to my car. Well, here's my car. Might as well start off with the trunk. We gotta hurry it up a little because it's raining. This is a lot more space than a stock average G. Dude, because I took out the spare and I only have what I need like jumper cables, portable air compressor, tools, blocks in case I get stuck, and transportation with a skateboard okay it's raining let's go inside this dirty car oh it's pretty comfy in here hmm. relaxing noises of the rain perfect time to do a video let's switch over to being a passenger everything's better as a passenger now we can see a little more of what i sit in and spend my time driving i spend a good amount of my time i drive so much in this thing nothing too major is done to this car honestly like all this is stock. Everything that I touch as a driver, I messed with or modified. The steering wheel, shift knob, and what I sit in is the seat. This is a thrash racing seat. Man, if you're wondering what kind of steering wheel this is, this is Renown and a custom shift knob. I have no idea what this is. Additionally, I have a rubber band here. This rubber band has a meaning to it. Once it breaks, I have another one. Might as well tell you guys, this rubber band I used to go to a community college, visit my counselor. My counselor was actually the one there for me the most during my first heartbreak. He recommended something to me is to wear that rubber band. Every time you have a trigger or think of that person where it distracts you, flick yourself. That notifies you how many times you're doing that in one day. It's a physical reminder pretty cool that's why i always have a rubber band here not to actually do that action but a memory that i've 
always appreciated. I don't have any back seats due to me not wanting to drive people, so I took it out and sold it. So I can never go back. It's too loud in this thing. For extra measure, I took out the seat belts on each side. Almost done here. And the glove, your normal stuff. Always have to have napkins in case something goes wrong. You never know. The center, not too much. I honestly don't really use all the space in this car. I like everything simple, as you know. Oh, TJ Hunt sunglasses from back in the day. Hunt and Co. I never wear sunglasses or hats. A souvenir that I keep in here. I know this was a quick video. This is what Vlogmas is all about though. If you liked it, let me know. Thank you guys for watching and stay tuned for the next one.